fighting pandemic has led to an unprecedented focus on health and well-being, be it mental or physical, thereby boosting allied services like the pharmaceutical industry. Hello and welcome, I am Meer Basmat with yet another episode of Aapmanir. In today's Aapmanir Burbhan, we speak about Dr. Ram Shroff, Director of Charak Pharma, a company that is almost as old as our country. Having been started in 1947 by the Shroff brothers, Dr. Ed Shroff and Dr. S. N. Shroff. According to a report by research platform, India Brand Equity Foundation, the pharma market was estimated to be worth $42 billion in 2021 and is slated to reach $120 to $130 billion by 2030. India has several establishments brands in the pharmaceutical space from Himalaya to Imani to Dr. Reddy's. A relatively new space called Pharmatech has also emerged in the last few years which focuses on telemedicine or online sales. Today, Charak Pharma has carved a niche for itself in the Indian as well as global market. It offers around 106 SKUs across categories such as dental, gynae, ortho and more and is present in two lakh outlets in India. Charak also exports to more than 30 countries including the likes of the US, UK, Greek, Portugal, Bulgaria, Ukraine, Kazakhstan, Tajikistan, Bangladesh, Sri Lanka and more. One of the ways in which COVID-19 has forced businesses to transform is the adoption of digital patient. And Dr. Ram affirms that this will save even though we have been in the offline space for decades now. The model has changed. In 2018, Charak Pharma launched its direct-to-consumer platform, Pedestry, which offers personal care products for skin, hair and gender. While the D2C website uh, was launched some time back, Dr. Ram says he realized the importance of scaling it up only in the last two years. Companies have realized that with rapid digitization, they need to reach out to customers directly. The third generation entrepreneur boasts the power of the brand lies in the fact that they manufactured their own products from their units local, located in Haryana, Marshall Pradesh, Kushra. Charak is known for products such as Kofor, Adizwa Capsule, Hyponet Tablets and more. He also says that with Vedistry, they want to focus on general but with limited medical support. We don't want to get into the serious medical conditions and sell those products on them. We don't feel it's the right thing to do, Dr. Ram Lippis. Going forward, they plan to adapt a hybrid approach wherein both online and offline channels are scaled. We have close to 1500 people on the ground, so offline will continue to be our focus. Both are bands. A registry which offers healthcare products and Moha, which offers personal care products, will serve as D2C platforms. Dr. Ram affirms the company is registering a 20% year on year growth rate in revenues. According to a report by IBEA, India is the largest provider of generic drugs globally. It is also the third largest in the world, world in terms of revenue and the 14th largest in value. However, the challenges within the sector are also numerous. Shortfall in manpower, scientists, pharmacists, and etc. Several high cost drugs not covered in insurance and high pricing of patented drugs are a few discrepancies in this sector. Nevertheless, Dr. Ram is optimistic that as the country progresses, these challenges will also find a solution. He says that comparing India with developed nations like the UK or the US is unfair. Even in the US, you have many people who are not insured or uninsured. Dr. Ram says he plans to introduce products in several categories such as women health, particularly PCOS, non-alcoholic, fatty liver, endometriosis, and more. The fundamental goal is to increase the basket of the products and ensure that they add value to the life of the customer and contribute to their health for long term. Growing young together, both Charak and our country has come a long way when it comes to ease of business through e-commerce or digital innovation. In many epochs, witnessing many chapters of history, it took a diamond jubilee for Charak to reach where they They say the part of courage is simple, consistency and how true is it in Charak's case. Thank you and stay tuned for more inspiring stories.